know what? These glasses are actually good. Shades, I mean, they're not glass. This is actually... Yeah, I just broke it. <laughs> Opinions are important to understand things from a, another person's perspective, but also to understand how a person thinks. Everyone is entitled to their own opinion. That is the truth. But being able to voice your opinion never gives you a clearance to force it upon someone. You should voice your opinion, but not to the point that it becomes hate speech. It becomes a form of control. And when you listen to others, you should not get offended so easily, of course, I mean, if there is a discussion when someone start calling others names and insults, then the best thing you can do is just get away and end the conversation then and there. It's pointless to continue that type of conversation, otherwise it's gonna be endless, or there will be a lot of nuclear bombardments of insults. It is never worth it. It is, it is never a good idea to continue such conversations. In a discussion and debate, I just want to add, when it ends, it can mean three things. One side wasn't prepared enough, there is not enough to talk about, or there is very little knowledge on that topic, or an infinite stalemate. However, we like to boast and sugarcoat our ideals. It is never a good idea to force something onto someone, because it never results in a positive effect, it just backfires in instantly, and drastically, I want to add. We get things done by communicating, exchanging ideas, views, knowledge of any kind in a peaceful manner, not in a heated argumental talk. Like for example, you're wrong, let me beat the hell out of you. For example, in Revengeance, both Armstrong and Raiden had the same idea, wanted to do the same thing, different paths to the same outcome. They didn't agree to each other and they settled out a deathmatch, who wins, he's right. We need to talk about things, to study them, to understand them more, whatever the thing might be. We need to set aside our bias for that, o otherwise we can start calling each other's names and saying your opinion is trash, or like the most modern one. The, 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 as, what did I ask? Did I, did I ask you for your opinion? Like, did I seriously? When someone does those things, then that someone has problems of their own that they project toward that someone who has the opinion. Or sometimes they think their view is the best and it's a perfect utopia. That's where the problems begin. Utopias are a paradise that suits everyone. It, utopias most of the time are molded, made by us, by the same person, by one mind, by one person's views. Basically saying how that person wants things to be done. It stops being an utopia the same second someone thinks any differently of it, from those set of ideals that that person made the utopia. Culture-wise, every culture has its own viewpoints and methods. All cultures are different. Good in one does not necessarily mean it's good in the other. Let's not change the structure of society or a country. Let's change ourselves. Change begins from within ourselves. We need to accept that others have a mind of their own, have their own opinion, and take what we can use. It is true that before and after the opinion, like in the memes, the world is the same, like throwing stones in a river. But someone can get an inspiration from it. Hmm. Maybe I should build up on that. We have the right to have opinions and think differently. Just don't make yourself the center of the universe. Actually, everyone is the center of their own universe in their own mind. But that doesn't mean others are, or wanna be a part of it, or they are following the, the gravity. You can opt not to listen to others' opinions, don't be surprised when they don't listen to you too. But when it comes to any questions and opinions, when you're asked, that way you also voice your opinion and you break the ice. Like for example in a company or in a meeting when someone asks you, someone has to be an icebreaker, someone has to pop the question. All in all, in the end, an opinion is just an opinion. But you should not let opinions get to you personally. Accept that there are other people thinking differently, just get, don't make it too personal. They have a different life, they have different things that happen to them. Everyone's unique. I mean, it's good if I listen to others' opinions, but if you keep basing your life, continuing your life based on others' opinions, then it's not your life. You're just living someone else's dream. Stay peaceful.